So kind of a review video. I recently saw this. <laughs> Yeah, on Instagram, kind of one of those superfood drink things. And it's backed by, I think, Dragon's Den, which, you know, I'm a little bit of a Dragon's Den fan. <laughs> oh my God. I'm a little bit of a Dragon's Den fan. Um, always intrigued to see what the, uh, the old dragons have backed. So with this, and it's 30 servings, so it, that should be about 30 days on this. I've actually noticed that I feel a bit more energetic, to be honest. Sometimes the coffee just does not hit it. I've noticed like, I get a lot of like headaches and things. So it's kind of cleared that up and trying to eat a little bit more healthily and uh, trying to sort my diet out and things. So hence buying this. I think I paid about 20 pound roughly. They offer a subscription. So this isn't promoted by the way. This is just something that I saw. It took my, uh, my uh, curious magpie fancy. So it claims to be an organic superfood blend. So it has baobab, I'm not entirely sure what that is, barley grass, which is really good for you, chlorella, moringa, pineapple, I've heard of pineapple, wheatgrass, wheatgrass is really good for you, spirulina, and camu camu. <laughs> I don't know what the hell those are, so I'm going to have to Google them. But it's organic, gluten-free and vegan friendly, so um, yeah, I mean, the taste and the smell, not great, if I'm honest. It's really easy, you just put a teaspoon of the blend in, I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of similar to um, the matcha powder, if you're familiar with that and it kind of does smell a little bit like matcha so I'm surprised there's no matcha in it. It, it doesn't smell great if I'm, I'm being totally honest but uh, most healthy things don't. Um, this is why we tend to crave sugar and sweet and like all manner of like unhealthy things. Yeah the taste is um, quite interesting. I mean the, the weird thing is it does taste like healthy you know, so you're drinking it and like, it does taste healthy, but it does not taste nice. I might do an update uh, once it's finished, see what the old uh, before and after thing is. Yeah, I mean, the, the tin for the best of the most part, I mean, it can be recycled. I think it is cardboard, but yeah, there's um tin coating on the inside. <laughs> I mean, it's really easy to make. It's just like one teaspoon water and um, it does recommend on the back that you add like a, a drop of lemon, kind of give it a bit of a um, tang, I guess, because it is very bland. <laughs> um, so what I actually did was put a little dash of um, cordial or uh, squash. And um, yeah, I mean, it's okay. Feel a bit better today from it, so. Um, yeah, let's see how I get on with it. So I might come back in a few weeks time and see <laughs> if I can keep it up. <laughs> That's the, uh, the thing with the health kicks, isn't it? That's it, really quick review video, uh, not sponsored by Real Foods. So yeah, I'm working on a uh, an art craft project at the minute and I'm trying to film it. Um, and see how it goes. Um, I have no idea how it will go because I'm still in the middle of uh, doing it. So <laughs> yeah, um, but it should be good. It should be entertaining and um, that's it. So if you found this helpful, entertaining, just whatever, do subscribe guys, girls, non binds uh, If you've tried real food, so um, drop a comment. Uh, let me know what you think of them. That's, that's it. Stay awesome, stay classy, be kind and bye. I'll do. <laughs> So kind of a repeated. So I'm a little bit of a, a dragon's dance. <laughs> I'm um, <laughs> I'm a little bit of a dragon's den friend. Friend. <laughs> no, that's, that's not that's in it. <laughs>